everyone welcome to the next session of answers tutorials in this session we are discussing about another type of beam analysis we are talking about cantilever beam we will see a point load that is applied on a cantilever beam and what kind of deformation stress and strain it is going to show i will first go to static structural and double click on it I'll rename the file as cantilever underscore point load. I'll go to geometry, right click, new design modular geometry. I'll go to XY, look at sketching rectangle. I'll draw rectangle and give it some dimensions. Say H1 is 50, B2 is 15. I'll extrude to form the beam. Say it is 5 mm. Generate. This is my geometry. I'll now go to model and double click on it. I'll now go to mesh. I'll change the sizing to fine. Update. I'll go to analysis settings. As we know, cantilever beam is a one wherein one side is fixed and on the other side you can apply some load or you can leave it as free. So I'm applying load on this side. Now either you can apply the load on this surface as I'm showing you here or I can choose edge option from here and I can choose this edge, right click, insert force. I will change vector to component and the direction as we can see is z. So in the z direction let me apply minus 1000. I will go to solution, right click, insert deformation directional. I am going to apply z direction here, right click, Insert strain equivalent, right click, insert stress equivalent, solution, right click, solve. I'll go to directional deformation and check the animation. This is how the deformation is going to look like. One end is fixed and load applied on the other end. This is the elastic strain and this is the stress on the beam. So this is a very simple analysis of a cantilever beam which is subjected to a point load. I hope you have understood the process of solving. See you in the next session. Thank you.